All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to our channel. We are Entrepreneurial Life with Tamara and Casey. And today we have Joanne on with us. Hey, ladies. How you doing? Hello. <laughs> Hello, Casey and Tamara. So excited to be here. I know. It's so nice to see you. <laughs> I'm glad Again. You make it. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Joanne's been on my other channel. So super excited to have her here as we know she is an entrepreneur building maybe not just one business between her and her husband, but a couple of things. You want to tell us what's, what's going on? What do you have going on right now? <laughs> yes, well, as I said earlier, that's um, a pretty loaded question. What do we have going on? Uh, so my husband is very like visionary and thinks that we can do anything, you know, so my, let's see, what businesses do we have? First of all, my husband has a website. Um, he works at the university doing computer programming, but now he's about to retire and he's going full time with his website business. But then we also have um, a German Shepherd business uh, that our children have. It's called Redwall German Shepherd. So we have one or two litters um, each year and they're actually German, German Shepherd. So um, great for, um, you know, police dogs, service dogs, and then great family dogs. Um, then also our 16-year-old daughter has brand me teas. Oh, um, and uh, I know that you have one of her t-shirts. And so she does that and does a lot of the teacher teas and then branding um, t-shirts for any businesses also actually anything that anyone wants done on their t-shirts. Yeah. And let's see what else. Do, oh, Zebra English. Um, I am with Zebra English and teach ESL online. So I help coach, recruit, and interview teachers um, in addition to teaching students. So that's something that um, you know, I have a website for. And then we are looking at getting into the RV traveling um, next year after my husband retires. We're actually taking a coach bus and revamping it. So we've torn everything out of it and we're about to rebuild because we have a large family and so it takes a 45 foot coach bus <laughs> and then for us to afford it too but uh, and then we want to try to build some type of business um, online too connecting RVs and churches together so that's a little bit um, in a nutshell about where we are right now <laughs> that is amazing <laughs> I am definitely a little like, busy. Here I thought I was busy and I just have two things going on. <laughs> well, Andrew and I are definitely go-getters too. So we love like-minded women that have, you know, the, gu the gusto, I don't know what you want to say, to go out there and get it and build businesses. So we're super excited about all of this. Let's see, where do we start? <laughs> well, um, you know, like you said, your husband has a, a company where he programs and, and does uh, website, you know, he can website build and, and do all of that stuff. Um, the one thing we found, Casey and I have found with our research of WordPress is, you know, even though you, you ha have the ability to attach a bunch of widgets to it, um, you still have to do that. It's still a little bit separate and it's a component of the website. Um, you know, with Groove, um, the one thing we liked about it was that we didn't need the website building or computer software background in order to be able to figure it out. <laughs> um, it's pretty easy to learn and then do it yourself. Um, and that kind of sold me a little bit on it. Um, I always like oh, yeah. show. Huh? Yeah. yeah it's, it's it's thing, if, I mean, because I would not know anything about it if it were not for Stephen <laughs> and what he does. I, I would need that. <laughs> yes, I hear you. And that's me as well. I just, you know, I, I'm trying to learn um, like the lingo and all of that, but it's not always so easy, <laughs> I must say. Um, so can you guys hear me? Yep. Yes. Hear you. Okay, good. Loud and clear. Loud and clear. That's good. Um, all right. So I'm just going to show you my um, screen, Joanne. Okay. And, um, and I just want to show you the platform just to see if it could be something that might work for you. Um, let's see here. Um, so we have, uh, whoops, sorry. We have um, GrooveFunnels. <laughs> and once you log into GrooveFunnels, 
um, you'll see a suite of apps. You went away. Are you still there? We're still here. I see you, but I don't see her. <laughs> she is. I think she's here. here. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> All right. Um, so you you open it up, and there's like a suite of apps. Um, you can see Groove Pages um, is basically the websites. That's that's your websites and your funnels. Um, and so right when you log on, you could see all, I mean, I, I have more than this, but this is what I've been working on recently. Um, and I could see this right here. Uh, Groove Sell, that's how you collect money. Um, and it just connects PayPal or there's a several pay options that it connects to. Um, hang on, I, I don't know why I clicked on it. But um, Groove Mail is an email provider and they're gonna have like, what was it, Casey? 100,000 contacts or something yeah. uh, included with the platinum price. So you can have a substantial email um, contacts. It doesn't have to be with, you know, you can have several emails as well, um, but it'll let you have a lot of people on there. Um, and just for $100 a month, you get double that as well. So that's pretty cool. Um, Groove member, like as soon as you said that you were thinking about building like a tribe in a way or a, a, a group of people, um, Groove member is basically, it's, it's like a course builder um, similar to Kajabi. But, um, but it also lets you do some videos, lets people leave comments, um, and it puts everybody in one place so that you can all connect with each other and learn and grow together that way. Um, Groove Video, Groove Video hosts your videos. So if you don't, you know, you can host them on YouTube a little, you know, I guess, but, um, but you can also host them here. And then also once you do a video, you can put it right into any of the Groove apps. Um, you can do it by YouTube as well. So it's very easy to integrate that. Um, you just use a little YouTube number, but Groove Video, you know, it's just kind of a drag and drop where you stick it right into your, your member, your course or your mail or your, or your um, web page. Um, Groove Blog, just that, it's a blog. Um, Groove Cart is really cool. And I also thought about that because Groove Cart is your store. So you don't need Shopify, you don't need Kartra. Groove Cart will host, um, for example, one of the founders of Groove, um, of Groove Funnels, he has a million dollar e-commerce store with um, shirts. So basically he designs the shirts and then um, you purchase them, I think through like Teespring or something like that. But, um, but he has like a multi-million dollar shirt, t-shirt <laughs> store. And, um, and he now uses Groove Cart to host that store because you can have, and you can have unlimited stores as well. So you can have your t-shirt store, you can have your, um, you know, if you, let's just say you're going to sell some RV products, you can have that store, you can have your blueberry store, you can have your German Shepherd store. <laughs> I love <Right>. blueberries. <laughs> I always bring up the blueberries, but you can have a separate store for all of your little businesses, you know, and your, and your shops. Um, oh, cool. It is really, it's like really an all-in-one type um, application, you know, a whole suite of apps. Um, so Groove Affiliate. Now, um, Casey and I recently learned about the, the founder, Mike Phil Same's marketing strategy. And what he teaches is um, it's called butterfly marketing. And, um, and so you basically you give something away that people think you're crazy to give away. And then you offer an upsell that's even more valuable, um, you know, that people just can't live without. And so they, they do the upsell that ties into the free thing, product or service. Um, so that's what Groove is. Groove is like you get so much for free. <laughs> But you're still limited on that free and you realize you like it so much that you upgrade to platinum. Um, and, uh, you know, so it's really, um, but then you make all of your people, you make them a member 
And then that membership gets their information, kind of like their email, their name and what you need from them. And you make them all affiliates. So as soon as somebody, um, you know, for example, Casey and I are going to do a challenge where we um, teach people how to use Groove. And so we're making everybody a 40% affiliate so that they can promote Groove Challenge, our, our Groove Challenge, and then we'll get more members. So um, especially digital courses, especially like, like if you, um, the, the RV travelers, um, if you charge to be a member of that, then right. if you make your members affiliates, you know, a, a substantial affiliate, like a 40% affiliate, um, then they will tell all of their friends about it. Um, you know, there's always going to be people that don't promote it or that just can't seem to get the word out, you know, right. right. Kind of like with VIP kid, no matter how much I tell people about it, nobody wants to do it. <laughs> but, um, but it's, um, you know, so you're always going to make your money for sure off a good handful of members. But then those members that are able to promote your group, your membership and spread the word, you're going to grow like wildfire, you know? Mm -hmm. And, um, and so this platform was designed in order to implement this butterfly marketing philosophy, you know? Um, right. and so like, like the RV traveler group is a perfect example of this. I mean, the German shepherds would not be a good example because you have a limited supply. And so right. it's not something that can go viral, but the, um, but the travelers is a is like a membership, you know, a, a group of people that um, you know, like minded people that that when they tell their friends and their friends tell their friends and their friends tell their friends, <laughs> then it just grows. And I mean, that's uh -huh. how Groove started one day, and they sent it out to their email list of like a thousand or something, and all of a sudden they had nine thousand <laughs> subscribers overnight. Wow, nine thousand, yeah. and um, it was just because Amazing. of the strategy that they um, that they that they put out. And so you make something free that's amazing, which a lot of sales sites will not do free because they want your credit card. You might get a free trial or you right. might, you know, you might have a limit of a dollar or something, but not free where Groove right. allows you to charge nothing <laughs> for something amazing. And then, and then you have an upsell where you try to get people to, um, to buy the, the major course or the major amazing thing, <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. um, and the other strategy with that is that your free members if that's what you choose, like your free members, they may not have as much access and they only receive maybe a 20% affiliate fee payout right. versus the paid members who get 40% affiliate. So it more than pays for that membership, if that makes sense. Um, and then in the future, they're going to have Groove webinars. They're going to have live streaming where you can, um, you know, just like StreamYard, where you can stream to multiple devices at once. Um, right. They'll have live webinars. So basically where you can, um, they call it live webinars, but it's like Zoom, kind of like we're doing right, right now where you can, you can talk and chat and share your screen and all of that live. And then they're having um, Groove Evergreen webinars where you basically record yourself with the webinar and then you can put the webinar up and people can do a live chat, but, um, but it's, it's a pre-recorded webinar basically. Mm -hmm. Um Groove Desk, I clicked on that too, and I didn't mean to, but Groove Desk is like a help desk. So if people need you right then, um, then you can you can be there for like a chat bot and that type of, or not a bot, but a chat, <laughs> a chat service. Uh, you know, they're also going to have Groove Calendar, which will take the place of Calendly. And, um, and they're going to have Groove Survey, which will give quizzes. So, you know, which which German shepherd is right for you? You know, what's your personality type? You could do a fun little quiz for someone that's <laughs> maybe, or maybe right. you could do a, a, a survey or a quiz to even see if you want to sell the dog to a certain family, because I know yes. that, um, yeah, not everybody's the right person, <laughs> you know, the that's right. right. <laughs> yes, for sure. The surveys and the quizzes help get them on your email list. So it helps. Build that's your great. Topic. Yes, that's true. Right. You know, that's a good freebie too. But, um, 
Um, but it's nice that it's really all in one and everything is very drag and drop, you know? Right. Um, now, so I have a question with the group calendar. Are you able to book through group calendar? I guess if it's like Calendly, then you calendar. Yeah, it's going to be like Calendly. You can book. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's not launched quite yet, <laughs> but it's... Um, you're going to be able to see um, flexible schedules. You can do a, an entire, you know, like a sequence of class schedules. So it's on your calendar right there, like Google Calendar, I guess. It's yes, yes. Um, add reminders. So people, you know, will get texted right away, if, you know, to make sure that they're going to come. Um, yeah, just like Calendly. But you don't have to pay for it. It's all included. So, right. you know, I know the reminders on Calendly is an extra fee, but um but with or the text reminders, I guess. But um, but here it's it's included in the in the app that you know that you will receive, whether it's free That's or awesome. paid. You receive the Groove Desk, um, wow. or the Groove Calendar. So there's a lot that they include. Um, you know, like we said, the free version is is a smaller version. Um, mm -hmm. Like you'll only receive you'll only have one membership, for example, of a hundred members. So one right. membership with a hundred and your group grows rapidly, then you're, you know, I don't know what you do, but do um, that page up if you'd like me to share that screen. So she can uh, see how many contacts. Contacts. You, you had talked about the free versus platinum earlier. Oh yeah. You have it right there. Let's see. I'll stop <laughs> and you can start. <laughs> Um, we work together. We're, we're good teammates over here. <laughs> so Tamara was talking to you about this, and I just find this interesting. So with Groove Pages, this is what you have with the free. So you can see the free versus unlimited, but even with the free, you still have all of the, <laughs> you know, three custom yes. domains and websites. And here's the Groove cell that she was already talking about. Um, what I wanted to show you... <laughs> um, I'm going kind of fast. There's the members she was talking about. And then the Groove Mail. So you have 500. Oh, 10, I said 100,000. <laughs> 500. off by a zero. <laughs> 10,000 with the um, paid version. Um, and then here's the transaction fees are quite a bit different too with the free versus mm -hmm. the platinum. I told Tamara that my goal, and I even wrote this to the you know, the higher ups in Groove Funnels, um, that my goal is to start paying $100 a month for Groove. That means I need, you know, 100,000 contacts and one <laughs> terabyte of storage, you know. <laughs> so yes. this is the paid versus the, the free. So I just, I don't know, I find it interesting to, to so look at. The that. paid $100 a month, is that what that is? I mean, that is like for Groove, is that $100 a month? When you outgrow, if you're if you're at this, oh, that's point, when you <laughs> ah. If you're at this point, a hundred dollars uh -huh. a month is not. Yes, it's not much at all. <laughs> if you're at that point, so right. that's my that's my goal is to get to that point. So um, you pay for one time. You pay one time for Groove. It looks like it was still. I saw it at the top. It was still thirteen ninety seven. Yeah. Um, so you pay one thousand three hundred and ninety seven dollars. And you have Groove for life. Um, you have all of the wow. apps. It's because they haven't launched everything quite yet. It's still in beta. Mm -hmm. It is still buggy. We will warn you. Um, there's, you know, not, it's not terrible, but it's, um, but there are some bugs in it as well. So, um, you know, it's a learning curve. They have an excellent support team. They have people just always willing to help in, in their Facebook groups and other places as well. Um, but they, um, but yes, because it is in beta, because they haven't launched everything yet and because it's not perfect, then they are willing to give it to us, to, you know, um, for, for the one price, um, that's out of control because they want it to kind of go viral and they're making everybody 40% affiliates who pays, um, for wow. it. So if you can get three of your friends to join, then you'll start making money, um, already, Instead of oh, you know, explain that to me, if you get three of your friends to join, how, how does that work? If three of your friends pay <laughs> for, okay. for the platinum, the 1397, uh -huh. um, right. so you make 40% off each sale, 
then okay. you'll make 40% times three, you know, 120% basically. Um, wow. So, I mean, it, it, it only takes three to pay and you actually earn a little bit after that. Right. You know, That's pretty that amazing. Pay. It is. So you get all of this for nothing, really, as long as you have, you know, three people to, right. to kind of show it to. Um, but it just, you know, I liked it because you don't have to make decisions. You don't have to rely on other people to build it for you. You don't have to make decisions oh. on which email provider should we get, which platform should we do this, which widget should I choose, which any of that. It's all right okay, there. Okay, so I have a question for you regarding this because I'm also part of um, an like ESL group that's called Learn With Me Languages. I don't know if you've heard of it or not. I but we were just talking about um, this. It started last year and it's where you meet um, once a week with a family. Uh, like if, um, so it's with um, Spanish. And so we'll be matched up with like a family in Mexico. Oh, wow. We both work on this um, work, work curriculum that's sent to us like the you know week before. We'll work on that and then we'll get together with uh, the whole family will yeah. and, and you know practice with one another what we've learned. Okay so the issue that we're having um, that the founder is having is creating something like you do in Kajabi but what she's not really pleased with is that there are not um, like automated emails that are sent out like to remind you. Would that be something that Groove would cover? Um, yeah, well, Groove has Groove. <laughs> so again, everything is in the- Yeah, I know. It's, it's it would be perfect if it was out. already launched, yes. <laughs> right. But Groove Mail has automations and then Groove Calendar has the dates. So if you set the calendar to run an automation, then it would email and, and text them, or if they have cell phones, but it would it would make sure whatever method they want to use, they'll be reminded. Okay. Um, but you said in Groove, there is something like Kajabi. Is that right? Yes, I can show you actually. Um, yes, we, um, I mean, we're just learning too. So bear with me. Well, while but, you find Groove member, um, like she was saying, the Groove Mail should be around the beginning of May. Mm -hmm. um, I heard end of April, beginning of May to be back up. But the calendar, I think, was that June? <clears throat> um, I believe so. Yeah, it's. I think it's maybe June. But it's, um, yeah, and it'll, it'll do everything. But even Calendly would work with, um, I mean, I put Calendly as our funnel for scheduling a coaching call before, Calend before Groove Calendar's out. Um, but the members, okay, hmm? okay. So, do you want, what I'm asking is okay, like in Kajabi and in Thinkific, those are the two being considered. And we've tried out the Kajabi, but it, because we want it to be where you see what you need to do watch this video, complete this activity, you know, do XYZ. And then after you do that, um, then it shows how many you've completed, you know, just like we do in, you know, our membership group. Right. But what she's wanting is um, to keep up with where the members are, like them being reminded to do this. If they haven't done it for that week, you know, being reminded to do that. I wonder if Groove would have a function like that within a course. Yes, that, that is um, a great question. I know. Yeah, I will to, ask and I will get back to you. What, yeah, what because they, I mean, it would be like perfect for her if, <laughs> I mean, right. we were just talking about this, trying to figure out what to do. And, and it's like both of those, like the Kajabi and the Thinktific are, you know, they meet some of the needs, but not the full scope of what she's wanting for her course, right. you know, families, which I can benefit from because like, I need that reminder if I haven't done something and, right. and seeing how much you've done and how much you have left to do. I mean, that's awesome. And to have it all in a courseware mm -hmm. that you can log into and see that. Well, I know that you can, um, you can check your students progress. And right. so if they have not completed a certain task, then you can um, remind them manually for sure. I do know that. Um, but I will have to ask if there's an automated reminder. Yeah. Because that I think 
I mean, this would be perfect because like they need to do a website and they have this membership. I mean, I think this, uh, the group <laughs> funnels would be perfect for them. Right. And the price is right, you know. Yes, it's it is. <laughs> much to, It's less than a year of Kajabi for life, you know. Absolutely. Um, I, we did talk to Tim, the um, Tim um, online teacher dude, and yes. he did say, you know, they both work very similarly. Kajabi just being around longer, you might make it a little prettier, but they're right. very similar um, in what they do. So what you do is um, with the course, um, let's see. So I, we haven't done much yet because we're still working on this, but um, you can go and every membership has to have a home. I don't know why I keep refreshing it. Every membership has to have a home page. Um, so I haven't done anything because Casey and I are going to do a video, but um, the only thing you need to do is, is add, you click on the plus button and then we're going, because we're going to do um, like maybe we'll do a YouTube video. So I'll just drag and drop this here. And then now I have a video placeholder and, um, you know, and I can move it and, and change locations a little bit um, using this plus icon. It kind of, I can put it above the home button. I could put it, you know, closer up there. I can do a little bit with that, um, with, with where it's located, but it has a video placeholder, um, the home button, it's really easy to just um, make it how you want it. Like, let's say we don't like white, so we want to make it green or, you know, like dark green or something. Right. It's all you have to do is click a button. You can even, um, you know, like Casey and I are, um, we're doing a, you know, our challenge thing. So we could do, a, you know, our, our logo, we can upload an image right there. Um, and then select, they also have free images, but I can put, you can kind of see my logo down there in the bottom, <laughs> but mm -hmm. you can use it as your background. Um, and it's that easy. Like you can just do everything with the push of a button, <laughs> you know? Um, and it, it really helps the parallax, you know, that just means as someone's, um, Let's see, as you scroll through, it stays or something. I forget what it means. But oh, yeah, see, the, the logo stays put, even though I'm scrolling up and down. <laughs> I think right, that's... yeah. Um, especially when you, I mean, I have the video there. I need to remove the video. If you want to remove, you say, oh, I don't want a video yet. Then you just click on the trash can and the video is gone. Um, but it's a very um, easy to get to know um, platform, you know. Um, and then... Yeah. So the outline, that's the, um, you know, if you want to purchase a domain and then there's a subtopic, how to purchase your domain. Um, and then that's where your materials will actually be. And then you can, I put in a video there, how to um, purchase through Namecheap. Now Groove offers you, you can still purchase through Namecheap, but um, host it right there. You don't have to go through Cloudflare to do it. Um, but Anyway, you can, and then um, we have like, and you can put in a checklist, but it's just so easy to just make everything how you want it um, right there. Um, over here on the left, um, you can see the entire course, all the materials that are available to you um, at that time. Now um, I'll show you, um, let's go back to the membership, um, save it. I'm going to, well, I'm going to exit. I don't want to save it actually. So we're going to go back, um, to the groove member and I'll show you how easy it is to, um, and we hope we can go back. <laughs> I don't think I have to save it. Yes. Okay. Leave. And then, um, when you go into groove member itself and everything with groove is basically done the same way. Um, so if we go to um, edit right here, edit, you can see this screen of editing tools. Like this is everything that you do in Groove follows the same sequence. Um, you know, Groove cell, Groove cart, Groove member, everything follows the same thing. So you put in your basic info, what it is, save and next. And you can see it said sales page. So that links it to your website right there. Um, and your website does not have to be through Groove. 
in order to link to your sales page, which is also kind of nice. That's cool. Yes. Um, So it automatically, it can be hosted by someone else for sure. The instructors, um, we could customize our instructor. I could do the great KZ Oswald as our instructor for this course. (laughs) I love it. I know. The builder, that's where we just were. So that's where you put all of your content, content in the builder. Um, your comments, you can have, you can have where everybody can enable comments for everything. Uh, maybe we don't want them to have comments on the home screen, but we want them to be able to comment on the lessons. Um, mm-hmm. So you decide what you want comments on. Um, the comments are going to be your conversation. As of now, they don't have plans to do like a, a Facebook type platform. Um, Mm -hmm. But the more people that encourage them to, the more likely they'll listen and say, okay. Um, So I act like I really want, well, I don't act because I do really want it. (laughs) I tell them all the time. It would be so nice to have like a group community because they do. Um, You can also have auto approve all comments or they must be approved by an admin, um, Mm -hmm. depending on your, you know, especially with teenagers and stuff, you might want to um, have to approve it all. (laughs) Right. Um, um, Access levels. Now, this is what you were, um, what you were thinking about here is, um, so we have the free version, we have the the challenge version, and then we we have another one with coaching, but the coaching and the challenge people are going to get the same thing. Um, The free version Like what our plan is that they're going to get it for our challenge and then we're going to turn it off so they Mm -hmm. won't have access. And all we have to do is just flip the switch. So whatever we want, if the challenge people get, you know, the home page, everybody, I think everybody has to get your home page. You can't change that. But every other page you determine what, what, who has access to what, and that's all you do by flipping it. Um, if you want to add a new access level, a new payment level, it's just this plus up here, and then you can name your access level right there. Um, and then over here, this, um, this, this square is where you decide, do you want everybody to have access right away? Do you want to drip feed it? So, um, you know, and that's where they don't get the content. No, they get it after a number A number of days. Yeah, I'm wondering Mm -hmm. if they have this reminder, because a lot of times there are, I don't know if there is, but I know that some people won't let you move on until you finish the previous, Um, but I think they have to do it manually. Um, Mm -hmm. But the drip free feed, that's what like Nancy uses and and people. And then, um, or you can, you know, let's just say we want this available on Christmas, (laughs) no matter where you are in the membership, you get this on Christmas. So, or something. Right. Right. (laughs) Um, So like we're going to do drip feed for our post because um, we want, or actually we'll probably do access from a specific date because our challenge starts on a date and everybody will be having access to the materials every day. So Mm -hmm. we'll have to um, put in the dates for each, for each um, right. that we do. Um, I'll just update that there because that's what we want. Um, but that's and really even, your course, huh? Right. And even like the language program, when we come around holidays, if it's like Christmas, regardless of where you are in the course, like you were saying, you all get the Christmas packet to work yeah. on. Oh, you know, that's neat. Christmas. Yeah. So the same type. You know, and you can it. store it in Groove and then just have it access at Christmas. You can have the right. date and then it'll just go out at that time, you know, and then you turn off access any other time, you know, so, or whatever you want to do. But yes, you just get access on that date and it's, it's pretty nice. Um, they're going to send a default welcome email with your login, your username and password. Um, they'll default, they'll, you know, and then you can go in and change it if you want. Um, I don't know why anybody wouldn't want to send a welcome email. (laughs) I know. I know. So your membership's been created and that's how easy it is to do, to have a membership. Um, and that's it. And then, um, you know, and then you have to, you, you do need to, all you have to do is, um, you can link it to Groove Cell. That's how you get paid for it. 
um, and Groove Cell, if you, I mean, if you're interested, <laughs> Groove Cell has yeah. the same, um, same sequence. And that's all you do with Groove Cell is um, go through the same process as Groove Member. And that's what makes Groove so nice is it's like, I mean, I don't have any experience in this kind of thing and I'm able to, um, to learn it quite pretty easily, <laughs> you know? Right. I mean, there's a little bit of a learning curve, of course, with everything, but um, but it's doable, you know, and that's the thing. Um, so you would go to your product funnels here in this one, and then you could see different ones that, that you're doing. And um, and then your actions, we'll just go to the challenge one again, but you um, manage your products here, and that will, again, take you, you, you click on the edit button and that'll take you to that same sequence of events, right? Um, so we're offering a free challenge and then this is an upsell challenge because we would like right. to pay for it, you know? Um, and then you go, you know, your pricing, this is how much it costs. Is it one time? Is it every mm -hmm. month, you know, or every year or whatever? Right. Can you pay in installments? Um, or recurring installments. And you can add as many price points as you want here. Um, That's which pretty it, cool. It is. It's so cool. that, And it's so easy. You know, you just put it, plug it in and that's it, right? Um, and then your gateways, that's how you're going to get paid. So, um, you know, you set up gateways. They have Groove Pay, mm. which is the lowest price anywhere. And you can have members pay or people pay from around the world and they don't charge a currency conversion fee, which is pretty nice. Yes. Um, yeah. Cause especially with something that, you know, that you can have worldwide members, it's, it's really nice to not have to pay that fee, you know? So group pay would take like a credit card, debit card type uh, <laughs> for their pay. Yes. Group pay. It has the lowest um, rate. Right. Exactly. Pretty cool. I'm familiar with Stripe. So Stripe, Authorize.net, NMI, PayPal, Braintree. Um, those are all different ways right now that you can pay. Um, right. They're of course encouraging everybody to use Groove Pay, <laughs> but um, but yeah, you can pay. Um, you can do it anyway. Groove Pay, you have to be accepted. Um, so they just want to make sure you have your your ducks in order. But um, right. but it's quite easy, and the guy is very nice to work with. We just haven't gotten our, our API code yet, but they let it will us. be, huh? I said, if they let us. <laughs> <laughs> they let us. No, but it's it's just, it's a great, great way. And the other thing about, about Groove Pay is once you're, once you're there, you can, you can accept money. Like they're never going to just close your account or turn it off. You know, let's just say you have a huge month. They're not going to question you. You know, they might say right. something. They might say something, but you'll have it within a day. And so it's it's nice that way. I know I remember that PayPal fiasco, you know, a few years ago when people just started making money and then PayPal was like, oh, you're making too much. We're not going to give you your money. Um, oh. Groove will not do that. <laughs> they have assured everybody that they will not do that. That's um, right. Yes. Um, so this is where it links to your website, your sales page, your thank you page, your refund period, oh, I forgot to put in the refund period, your refund period, your support info, um, you can you can link all that right here within the Groove Cell um, area. Um, check out, that's, um, that's what it's going to look like. Um, they are really close to being able to customize your, your checkout, um, but if you just have this one, it's going to... Um, Oh, it's not previewing for me, but it's basically you'll have pink on the top. I can show right. you that thing. Um, what do you want to ask your members? And I like this because you can customize it. Um, you have to you have to get their first and last name and email, and you actually have to get their country and state. They said that was an error, but nobody's fixed it yet. <laughs> um, but it's not. It's not such private information that people aren't willing to give it to you. Um, you can choose what you want to ask people. Um, we chose what would you like to use Groove for, but you can add any fields you want to. You know, are you living in an RV? <laughs> you know, <laughs> um, you can ask just really anything, and um, 
And, and that will be a custom field that people are asked at checkout. So I thought that was kind of cool that how easy that yes, was. Yes, it is. <clears throat> yeah. Um, your bump. So we're activating the bump offer. So if somebody says, um, so if they order the free, the paid version, the $47 version, it'll automatically ask them if they would like the $97 version, <laughs> you know, yeah. um, you know, sometimes you can get it in the situation where you might seem a little too, <laughs> too ambitious, too salesy. I don't know. Um, but we're, we're going to try it and see how it works there, you know, but, um, yeah, I don't mind it. I mean, because sometimes I want that extra and other times if I don't, I'm just like, no, thanks, you know, and go on. So yeah, and that's all you need to do. We'll never yeah. know the difference. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> yes. Uh, here it asks you the upsell page. So then it's automatic. As soon as you purchase something, it'll ask you right there. Cause this, this page, that's all, you know, that's what it does. And that's how easy it is to put that into practice is just type in the, um, that you can up type in the thank you page or the upsell page. And it's pretty easy to, to do. Um, and then fulfillment. Um, so this is where you link your membership with your, um, with your, with your price, with your website and your price point and everything else. So these people all have the challenge for life, um, that paid the $47. Um, and then these people will have the coaching call. So they'll go to a separate thank you page where they can schedule their call, but they're automatically oh. added to that membership level right there, depending on their price point. So there's nothing manual we have to do. There's nothing on the back end we have to do. It's just an automatic flow, um, which is pretty nice. Um, they do, like I said, they love their affiliate um, affiliate uh, program, you know, everything there. So we did an override because we're giving 20% to the free people and 40% to the paid people. So you just have to, on the free plan is where you really override it, but the paid plan too. Um, you can do custom landing pages. You can have, um, JV means you're getting other people to promote your product, even without purchasing it themselves. Um, so I'm about to start this math homework club where I'm going to help kids with their homework. And, um, and then I, I'm going to offer a JV affiliate program so if you want to promote my club, you don't have to be a member of it. You can promote it without being a member using this JV affiliate and, um, and then you'll get 30% for promoting my club. Wow. <laughs> so, that's pretty cool. I like that. I know. I, I, yes. Cause you know, it's those things where you want a lot of people, you know, then you want to mm -hmm. appeal to people that can also target their audience. Even yes. That's they, smart somebody themselves. So it definitely works for that type of, of thing. Um, integrations, if you, we, um, Casey and I actually just, um, just uh, signed on with Active Campaign. So we can integrate right there an email with Active Campaign. This is the wrong Active Campaign, so I'm not going to do it. But, but you can do that right there. There's a lot of um, integration tools that you can use um, with different, you know, platforms mostly emails. <laughs> Before a groove mail comes out, then, um, then that's what it is. Um, this is what your affiliates are going to see. So I'm okay with my affiliates seeing their affiliates' email addresses. I don't want to give them their phone or at, um, their physical right. address. Mm -hmm. um, and then the affiliate bonus delivery. I, you know, why not just let your affiliates do whatever they need to do to promote your product? Um, this is what gives them permission to use different things in order to promote your product. Um, so I'm, I said yes to everything. I don't know what it all means, but, but I still said yes to everything. <laughs> um, the proof widgets, it shows in the bottom, or wherever you want it. It shows in the corner, any corner that you choose. Um, so-and-so just purchased the group 21 day challenge, you know, and I always like when those things pop up. So it's really right. Cool. And then you're done, finish. Um, and then you, you do have to put this into your web page, um, but that's also very easy to do. You just copy and paste it right into your, your web funnel. 
um, and then you're done. And that's, that's it really. <laughs> um, so, I mean, if you'd like to see anything else, you're welcome to, um, I could show you anything else. Otherwise, um, it's very much um, drag and drop. You know, I could show you a web page too, if you would like, but <laughs> it's not really a tutoring session. I just get really excited with all of this stuff. Um, but you just open up. Oh, this is not what I wanted to open up because this is this is what Casey and I were doing already. But you just go up here and you get a new site. Um, and then it has a lot of templates if you would like a template to start with. Mm -hmm. um, it also has complete websites. These are complete website templates. Mm -hmm. um, there's funnels. Um, it did start as a funnel builder, which allowed website or not allowed, but had websites available for you to do. But they still very much promote funnel building more than websites. Mm -hmm. um, and then just anything that you might have that you liked that you saved. Um, so you can do, um, you know, whatever you want to, but, or you can start from scratch. Um, but all you got to do, I will do, I guess we can do a, a preview one, but, um, you know, blueberry book, because I like blueberries. And then <laughs> we start That's my blueberries, Casey. I like and I'm going to have to come and pick at our blueberry farm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> one day, one day. I don't think Casey's very far from you, right? It goes Florida, Miss, uh, Florida, Florida, Mississippi, Alabama, right? You're on the border of, oh, Alabama's first. Yeah. I need to know my I'm geography. Far. I'm four hours from Mobile. So how far are you from Mobile, Casey? <laughs> I have no idea. I've lived here for a year, but I've been in COVID, so I haven't traveled. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so how far are you from Panama City or Pensacola, do you know? Um, I'm right there. <laughs> are you near Panama City? I I am in Panama City, yeah. Oh, okay. I forgot. Yeah, so if you're Panama City, oh, that's like six hours from me then. Okay, that's not so bad. Yeah. That's not bad at all. And actually, my hometown, you're only like an hour and a half from Dothan, Alabama is my hometown. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. So Panama City is where we always went to the beach. Nice. I'm yeah. only a couple of... Uh, Tamara's only a couple hours away from my daughter, so I'm going to have to make a, like, a long weekend sometime and go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that would be fun. Okay. Yes. <laughs> um, yeah, I, so I don't, yeah. Um, what you do with a blank page is there's designs that you can have yourself. So if you're, if there's something that you want to include, like you want to include a checkout form, um, there's place, you know, there's forms for that, that you can say if you like it. You can also save forms from template websites that you don't like the whole website. You just like that. And then you can right. save it. Um, just click the star button, the star oh. icon, and it'll save that to here. Um, you know, resources, there's a lot of things, um, you know, that, that you can use as a, as a guide that isn't the whole site. It's just how you make it, how you want it. Right. Mm -hmm. Um, and all it is, like we said, it's just a drag and drop. So you just drag and drop everything that you want. Um, these are the, the blocks they're called. So these are the big content areas that you're going to want to include. You want to include a whole header. You want to include a checkout page. You want to include right. the big, the big guy right there, you know, yes. And then um, it does take a while when we're on Zoom. So this is a huge headline. And then you can add um, a container is just a placeholder. That's where something is going to go. Um, so let's just say you want to, um, like my math homework club, for example, has four price points, or it doesn't have four price points. It has four age groups, um, mm -hmm. same price, but four different age groups. So I want four columns of, you know, just so that people know that they can choose which age group that they want, right? Wow. Um, and that'll come soon. But then you can add an image into that container. You can add words, text into that container. Um, you can add a headline into the container. Um, whatever you choose, you can add into there. 
Mm -hmm. um, so the, you know, you can even do one of those carousels where <laughs> you see an image for every, you know, two seconds or whatever. I don't know. Right. Um, but you can figure all that out as you go. Um, you can include videos from YouTube, Vimeo, and or Wistia. <laughs> um, soon, grew videos or group like webinar type thing as well. Mm -hmm. um, and um, you know, just whatever you really want. If you want to make a checklist, this is all you get. We're gonna you know show you all the things you get with a check mark. Um, that's kind of fun. Um, and then you know to duplicate, you just need to. Um, uh, to duplicate the, the, what you already got that you really like, um, you just click on a little square and it'll, it'll duplicate it for you. They didn't, it didn't um, do it because I wasn't in the container. <laughs> but right. you see this double square, that just duplicates what you have there. Okay. Um, and then you can do different things there. Um, so it, it just is really amazing. If we, you know, we really love our headline right here that we're attracting visitors. So now I can put this here and it will ask your email and name and automatically send it to Active Campaign um, mm -hmm. or any of these other emails or, you know, even Kajabi is now integrated with, with Groove, which is pretty cool. Um, so anyway, it's <laughs> that's Groove in a nutshell. But, um, but everything works together. You just, it is a little bit like I have, to, you know, it said, what is your sales page and group sell? So you have to remember, you know, your, your URL for that. But it's really easy to, to figure out how it all sort of works together, mm -hmm. um, if that makes sense. But I will definitely ask if they would get a reminder. Um, I know Casey and I took two courses. Well, one they gave for free and one we kind of paid for. Um, but we did not receive, we received reminders. Actually, we did receive reminders that day that, oh, show up today because so-and-so is teaching. But, um, and so I know you can drip email, I guess, automations, but mm -hmm. we didn't receive anything for not completing a portion of it, if that makes yeah. sense. Good yes, yes. Both of us would be getting lots of those messages. <laughs> <laughs> I know. We're bad students. <laughs> I say we're good teachers, well, we're bad students. <laughs> no. <laughs> I have to tell you a funny story. When my husband first started doing his website business, it was 2010, and it was to help some friends um, so that they didn't have to pay these exorbitant uh, website developing fees, you know? Mm -hmm. And so I would watch him as he was writing and developing these websites. And I mean, just like to bring a color in. I mean, he would have to write this code right. and then he would have to. And I mean, I'm just like watching him write line. And I'm like, there, there, there's not just a button like a drag and drop yeah. or a button to push or. And there wasn't. I mean, he was having to write every bit of it. And I was like, oh, my word. You know, yeah, there's just I, he got paid for it. You know, now WordPress has made that a little bit simpler since they have these templates that he can use, you know. But yeah, this is amazing. Just, I mean, that's what I was thinking he should be doing. You know, can't you just, because as users, we're so um, used to, oh, push this button, click this, and it yep. just automatically appears. Yep. So there's all this code behind that. Right. And that's what he was having to develop. Yeah. And I was like, oh my goodness, so much work goes into just choosing a color right. you know, or something. Or and this. now it's easy, you know, it's easy. Yeah. But so it's watching you this. To integrate and you still have to figure it out, you know, how to do yes. it all. But yeah. Yes. So, and, and it's still, I, I, I still can't do any of that, you know, <laughs> but this looks very user friendly. It's very user friendly. It is still basic, you know, like it's still... Um, I mean, you could do an image and a, and a color and it very easily, I should have showed you that too, but, um, but I didn't, I'm sorry, but, um, but it's very easy, but, um, but it's still very kind of simple, <laughs> you know, yes. but I, I feel like they're just going to get more and more beautiful templates and sometimes having two oh, yeah. to choose from is just, you know, trouble yeah. too at the same time. That's it's, true. I don't know. <laughs> I can't. I don't know. <laughs> Yes. So awesome. I don't know. I hope we, I hope we showed you, <laughs> answered your questions. Um, but I will ask if, if there is the reminder for the lessons, because that would be pretty cool. 
Um, yes. I mean, if that, if they had that, I mean, I know she'd be sold on it um, <laughs> because that's where she's, you know, I mean, group looks like I'm, I'm going to pass all this information on to her because I think this would be really exciting um, for yeah. them to. That would so. be great. I just think it's going to yeah. get better and better. And as things open oh. and they yes. have such experts working on things, like, I don't even know if we said it earlier, but they have the man from Google that created the SEO. They have, you know, somebody that worked or started Kartra and, you know, all of these people and experts in their field right. sort of grew. So we just see it getting wow. better and better. Right. Well, yes, it, it seems like it could only go up from here. I mean, they have so much already to offer. Yes. And then to tweak those things and find out what people want and make that available. Yeah, so just tell them about that um, email reminder. <laughs> I will. I'll tell them for sure. In there, okay. since we're still in the beta form yeah. of it. The other thing is um, you can set, re you can set like the drip, for example, the drip. Right. Um, you know, if they're supposed to do it a certain day, although I guess if you give them a week to do the lesson, that wouldn't help. And um, everyone's at different points too. Like this person might be on week three and another family, they could be at week eight. Right. So that's why it sort of has to be True. to each family. Yes, for sure. Um, um, yeah, but and would do you guys meet on the same day? Yes, you do. Because I sometimes there are email automations that also will yeah. automatically say, "Don't forget to do this." Um, right. We, even if they don't, if you did, you know, you'd have to say, well, I don't know if you did it or not, but I'm sending you the email anyway. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> but After I don't know. Three days and right. don't forget. Don't That's forget. right. That would be better than um, nothing. So. Yes. Yes. It's yeah. fun. But. Awesome. Well, thank you both so much, Tamara. That was an awesome tutorial again. <laughs> so yes. I didn't mean to give you a tutorial. Stuff. I just wanted to show you around, but it's no, fun. I loved it. I'm like, wow, Tamara knows so much. I mean, to be able to explain all of that, that's pretty amazing. <laughs> well, thank you. you. See, when it was all working together at one point, you think she's excited now. She's like, it worked. <laughs> when she was on. You know, oh, yeah. I bet. Oh, man. Super cool. Oh, yeah. Thank you everyone so much for coming and watching our video. Don't forget to check out Joanne. She's got Zebra English and we're just gonna add all of your links below <laughs> our video. Tamara and I have our links below as well and we'll see you all next time. <laughs> all right, thank you Tamara and Casey. This was awesome. Yeah.